So what is it that you want to experience? What is it that you want to be? Hello, trans surfer, and welcome to Transurfing TV. My name is Renee Garcia, and this is my video on redesigning yourself. I am going to do a little hybrid today, some motivational speaking mixed with a couple of concepts from the Transurfing book that I feel one should focus on if they do decide that they want to redesign themselves or their purpose or their reality. But first, before I get started, I would like to give a special shout out to Brian Scott and his amazing book, the Reality Revolution. Oh my goodness, he just sent me a copy and this book is gorgeous. It's like weighty. It's It really looks beautiful, like the aesthetic. He just nailed it. And the guts, I mean, obviously there's like so much stuff here. There's concepts and topics and tips and insights and all sorts of things having to do with uh, reality creation. So I think that Brian Scott, deserves a huge acknowledgement in this accomplishment because this book is not obviously <laughs> something that he threw together very easily. So Brian Scott, congratulations. This is an awesome book and I'm so happy for you and your endeavor. And this is really, really beautiful. So with that, I will get into the video redesigning yourself. So I am going to swear a little bit here for those of you that are put off or agitated by swearing. I would suggest turning the video off now. So I was watching Tony Robbins, the Tony Robbins documentary the other day, and he in front of his, I don't know, thousands of people that come to the seminar once a year, he got up in front of everyone and he was talking about his evolution in regards to what he has done with his life since being a young man. And he stood up in front of everyone and he said, I built this motherfucker, right? I built this motherfucker. This is my design. I built this person. And it went into all the things that he did, the, the things that he followed and what he embraced. And he's really big into meditation and all sorts of, I mean, if you have not seen the documentary, it is awesome. But this really got me to thinking because I feel this way about myself, right? I built this bitch. I am not a person that um, is special by any stretch of the imagination or was, right? I grew up in an environment that was very uninspiring. I didn't go to college. I didn't even graduate from high school. I haven't really had a lot of experience with any of the things that I'm doing right now. And I am simply using these concepts to help me connect with a higher version of myself and a higher purpose. And in doing this, I am redesigning myself. I am redesigning my life. I am redesigning my purpose, my trajectory, all of that stuff. So there is two things, two concepts that I really feel have helped me in this endeavor in redefining myself or redesigning myself rather. So the first one is my connection to the alternative space. And the second is uh, the alternatives flow. These have sort of been, and obviously things like the creator spark, getting, getting this inner fire, this inner light burning more brightly, and then looking to my environment, to my world, to show me the way that I can connect with all of these things that I ultimately want to become. So first, I am going to go over, for those of you that do not know, I am going to go over briefly lifelines and how we do connect to that higher version of ourself. So remember, if you want to adopt this visual representation, the linear lifeline sort of stacked on top of each other and the higher one represents your your ultimate self, your your ultimate purpose, all of the things that you want to be, have, do, all that good stuff. 
and we have to actively take a few steps in order for us to get to this higher place, but it's not hard. If you follow these concepts, it's actually quite simple. So how do you do this specifically? Well, first you have to envision which version of yourself or which reality you deem ideal. So what is it that you want to experience? What is it that you want to be? What is it that you want to do? This is you getting in touch with your soul frail. This is you really asking yourself some deep and meaningful questions right now. Are you satisfied with what you have right now? And do you want more or do you want more? And if you want more how much more what specifically do you want or what specifically would be satisfactory to you or make life a feast right I want my life to be a feast so I am shooting for the stars so first thing is envisioning that version of yourself you could go and look at my connecting with a higher version of yourself video the meditation that I give this will help sort of unlock some ideas of what the higher version of yourself looks or sounds like and you have to form a very comprehensive embellished vision of this higher version of yourself or your higher track right so then once you have envisioned this you must accept that that version of reality does in fact exist so it does in fact exist now you have to keep your frequency in tune with this higher version of yourself this is no more negative thoughts this is no more i can't do it or i'm not good enough this is you transcending your box of limiting beliefs and really now comes for the 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 the, the brass hacks of it taking the steps acting in the direction of the higher version of yourself so you act in the higher direction the the direction of the higher version of yourself what does that mean exactly okay so this is why i'm doing this right now with these videos with transurfing this is me taking steps in the higher in the uh, direction of the higher version of myself right towards my higher purpose i may not have it totally defined exactly what that is right now but i do know that i have a vague idea and it's much bigger and it's much grander than anything i've experienced or what i'm experiencing right now now i can pull whatever information opportunities anything that helps me to feel like I can take a step outside of myself in that direction. And along the way, my world, this is where the alternatives flow comes in, my world then presents to me more options, more choices, more opportunity, more information, more material that I can connect with and sort of climb these ranks right like a like a staircase up to that higher version of myself so getting into the alternatives flow alternatives flow is you stopping doing what you're doing now if it's forced or if you do not feel a hundred percent uh coordinated with your current intention and letting go and letting your world sort of take you on a journey of you know a journey of self really where the ultimate destination is this higher version of you this higher lifeline so i did not know that this was a possibility in the realm of possibilities i thought anything that i was going to become or anything i was going to do or anything that i was going to have was going to do solely with me right my inner intention thinking mind so it wasn't until i found transurfing and i accepted that my inner intention thinking mind is actually very very limited in order for me to re 
redesign myself, my life, my path, my purpose, all of that good stuff, I was going to have to assume that this, not assume, assume is absolutely the wrong word. No, I had to know that this version of myself does in fact exist in a parallel reality. And I had to trust that I did not know the ways to get there and give into my world to show me how I can resonate my thoughts in that direction, my action in that direction, and allow my world to sort of push me up the flight of stairs. So I want to end this video with this. Are you challenged by your lot in life right now? Do you feel that you have the ability to become something better? Do you have the, uh, do you have the vision to do something outside of the box that maybe has been calling to you and you have been timid to start. So this has to do with managing your pendulums and really getting yourself to a place where energetically you can jump off the high dive and go in the direction of this something bigger, something better, this higher version of you, this higher lifeline, because you're not gonna get there just sitting stagnant in the reality that you have created for yourself in this moment. You have to take steps, right? And you have to know that a very, very big version of yourself doing something great, doing something meaningful and purposeful does in fact exist if you choose that. Now it is totally acceptable if you just want to uh, keep living the life that you are living and you're happy with that, totally cool. But if you are ready to take a step and you are ready to jump off that high dive and go and swim and actually ascend to that higher version of yourself, this is the way. So with that, please like this video if you do in fact like it and comment in the comment section below. I love reality transurfing and enter my giveaway for my awesome reprogramming stickers. I'm sending out so many of these lately and I hope that you get some. Thank you so much for watching my video, everyone. Bye.